offseason program, which with us having a new coach this year would have uh, started next week in a normal year. But given the COVID restrictions that we're still operating under, um, everybody's offseason program is going to start on April 19th. I think that the hope is that uh, by the time we would get to, to mini camp and the later stages of OTAs, it might start to feel more normal like it would have been in prior years. Um, but between now and then, I think there's going to be some different protocols and those are still being negotiated. But I think we're getting, you know, in the direction of normal, but not quite there yet. I'm still working uh, very closely with the state and the mayor's office trying to bring as many fans back this fall to our games. It's certainly my hope. You know, I'm talking, as I said in the opening comments, to the state. In fact, I had a call with the state between the end of the league meeting and this press conference again today to keep dialogue going. Uh, I had a call with the mayor's office last week. Um, obviously, we're trying to do everything we can to help by getting people vaccinated. I think that's a key step in this. You know, with the FEMA vaccination site at Ford Field, I think we're doing between five and 6,000 vaccines per day there. Um, we'll be doing everything we can to support uh, PSAs to help other people um, get inspired to get the vaccines and understand how safe it is and how important it is to get back. I think if we continue on this trend, there's a pretty good chance we're going to have large gatherings of fans this fall, whether it's a full stadium or not. I certainly hope it's going to be way more than 750 friends and family. That's for sure. Pretty substantial change on how the international games are going to be uh, scheduled going forward. Um, in previous years, the host team in the international series had either been awarded a Super Bowl in their city or had been one of the teams that was relocating to a new market. Uh, going forward, I think beginning in 22, maybe 23, depending on how things fall, um, every team will be hosting a neutral site game once every eight years uh, in one of the international markets, uh, which are London, um, Mexico and Germany, with potential to expand into some other markets uh, later on. Has any consideration been um, given early to uh, uniforms and what you might do with them going forward? Um, have a you know, given some thoughts to that. Um, you're right. We're coming up on the you know window when we could make some changes. I haven't really you know gone into the design phase yet. Um, but uh, that certainly is something that uh, once the window opens up, we'll probably take a step back and look at the current roster that we have, any changes we want to make. Um, do we continue with the color rush, et cetera? It, it's on my mind, but nothing official.